Well, I'm sitting out here in my little smitty today and fixing to try to uh, do some uh, forge welding and work on some projects that I had really haven't had a chance to uh, work on. And I figured I'd make a little video with my new camera and glasses and uh, we got the, uh, the little uh, ring that I'm trying to make and forge weld in the fire and uh, we're gonna let him soak then we're gonna try to bring him on up there to where uh, to where it uh, blends in with the fire becomes warm with a fire and uh, we got our flux and our brush and my little hammer right here and uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna try to uh, forge well and I, I really hope it turns out but uh, I'm not real good at doing that but anyway we'll see what happens and uh, we'll go from there You're gonna hit you on the finger. I guarantee you it does. What do we got here? I don't think we got a porch well yet. Nope, I still see a seam. We're gonna go back to the fire, flux a little bit. I'm going right back in there. I am on a mission. This is my good friend Pete right here. He's a good old boy. He's 
usually hangs out with me when I do my my blacksmith and stuff. I've got the ring forge welded. Uh, forgot to turn the camera on last time, but uh, it took. And right now I'm trying to heat her up, heat her back up to pretty high so that I, I can get some of that slag off of it. I guess I should start myself in the habit of brushing all the time. Keep that brush right here handy. My boat back. anchor that I've been working on all done. I got him laying here on the anvil. This is what they call a uh, fluke style anchor. And uh, what happens is, is this ring right here will catch it. And if it gets hung on the bottom, just put that ring and slide up and then it'll come right loose. 